biggest takeaways from Husker camp so far. Um, mm. Obviously, the aggression of offers, and we hit on that earlier, continues. Mm -hmm. um, but then I'll say this. The numbers are up again. Okay. And I think we knew that was going to be the case. When you say, hey, we're going to make offers, and we're going to offer guys, and you back it up, more kids come to your camps, mm -hmm. younger players especially. The guest coaches have caught my attention. Okay. We saw North Dakota's head coach, oh, yeah. um, Bubba Schwiegert, at practice at the camps all weekend. We saw Tim po um, po Polisek from um, North Dakota State. North Dakota State. He, he was there all weekend with his coaches. Northern Illinois had coaches there. Northern Iowa's had coaches there. Um, so just the presence of regional programs, that has never really been the case at Nebraska's camps. Um, you know, under Frost, you might have saw one or two guys that they knew get in, uh, but not like just an open deal. And last year, Wyoming's entire staff was here. For, for a lot of the players, prospects, it, there's some pressure here. I mean, there's pressure to perform. I mean, they're trying to get looks. They're trying to get offers. And you know what? You know what we've seen? And we don't need to talk about names. We've seen some kids come to camp and not perform and not get an offer. You know, the 40, hey, the 40 matters. Yeah, that happens. The measurables, Matt Rule and his staff, they look at where are you there are things <clears throat> that you have to have to be a, a pro level player. Mm -hmm. Measurables, mm -hmm. speed, mm -hmm. testing data. All right. And if you're mm -hmm. lacking those key components, they can't make you into the player they want to build Nebraska with. And that and that's what so they really put a lot of stock into the measurables and the 40s and those things. Because they feel like our coaching and development here will get you to that point, a la Jalen Lloyd. Right. So, yeah, it's it's pretty – what I noticed is it's pretty intense. It's not just, a, you know, when me and you were going to basketball camps as youth, it was intense enough, but it was it was still kind of light. This isn't light. I mean, they're, they're, they're competing, and that's, that's the key word. The coaches are – they want players who compete and love it love to compete, aren't scared to come to camp and run for Matt Rule. And 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 there's some risk. There is some risk in that scenario. Oh, God, I just ran a 488. I may not get this offer, you know. So that's – it's not – it's there's risk involved. And that makes it that makes it kind of interesting. Yeah, I feel like when we were growing up, the Nebraska football camp was big for offering guys, but you just kind of went to camps to have fun. I mean, there, it right. wasn't high – like – I used to go living in Omaha. I went to Creighton basketball camp every summer, and mm -hmm. it was kind of fun. It was fun. I, I did win twenty bucks off Flip Saunders once. How'd that happen? So he had this game where he just threw dollar bills, crumbled them up on the floor, and if you got a question right or rose your hand, you got to go out and shoot, and you picked the spot. Mm -hmm. And I I didn't know what dollar bill. I hit a shot, got twenty bucks. Really, Flip Saunders went on to coach the Timberwolves. Yeah. What was he doing there? He was the Sioux Falls Sky Force head coach. Okay. And okay. he was a speaker. Yeah, I was going to say, what the hell was he doing? He was a speaker at the camp. Okay. Interesting. So I got I, I went over to the arcade back then and probably dropped all 20 bucks. Probably, quickly. Um, I don't want to say these camps aren't fun, but I think they're more fun if you're a competitor. Like, if you want to compete. Like, like the Northwestern quarterback that came here. Jalen and we're still waiting. Jalen you know, and, Graham staff. and I'm going to get into more of that in tunnel talk, but you well, know, yeah, we're not going to give up anything, you know. But he, yeah, the guys like that are fighting to get here, and I, I think you know they, they've extended a couple opportunities uh, to some of these guys that worked out. We'll kind of see how it all plays out here um, in in the coming days.